I worked with Frank at his previous company that was called Frank Williams Racing and when he decided to set up a new company uh, I joined him right from the beginning and that was in March 1977 and together we set up Williams Grand Prix Engineering. It was um, a small number of people uh, and I'm sure I was known to get my hands dirty at times. Our first car uh, was the FW06 which was a relatively simple car, quite effective but relatively simple. We didn't really feel that we were planning for a big future where Williams would have 500 people uh, but we were very competitive and we wanted to win races. I don't go to all the races these days. My job is essentially based around what goes on in the factories. So we'll have a transmissions department, a suspension steering and brakes department, a composites design department. To get the right people is extremely difficult and uh, very often we have difficulty in filling specialist roles. It's a question of uh, developing people internally as well in taking people on young so that we can promote them into more senior roles within the company. Uh, the difficulty for the conductor of the orchestra is to put together all of the different skills. I, I can get quite annoyed with things if they don't go well, but there's no point in uh, expressing that in any outward way. Sometimes I think I, I'm, I'm told I can look a bit grumpy. That usually means that uh, things aren't going well. Uh, I, I think I'm a fairly straightforward person with understood aims and within the limits of reasonable politeness. I hope that I uh, uh, openly let other people know what I expect and they can be open with me as well. The aim for the team going forward is to raise its capabilities so that we start winning uh, regular podium positions, uh, get back to winning races, and then win enough races within a year to win a championship. But that's quite a, a challenge, but uh, we're um, strongly committed to that, and I, I hope to see that within my time at Williams.